Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in retirement and having. When a man is seated in a good place where there's good light, he's going to make a recording. And when he makes a recording, he never knows who's going to be listening. But then again, he might know who's going to be listening. It really doesn't matter who's listening in an audience, does it? And it doesn't really matter what the person looks like on video, does it? We have radio hosts that are caught on television. It's sort of fascinating to watch the radio DJs doing their radio show on TV. I sort of liked when they do that. It makes me understand who people are. It helps me align their voices up to their faces and you go, wow, I didn't expect you to look that based on your voice. And it's a great way to remind us that we don't know everything God makes. Now in this lifetime, we have people who need us. And in this lifetime, we have people who profess that they don't, but maybe they do and they just don't acknowledge it. Maybe God has been speaking to them for so long, but they just say, nope, God, talk to the hand. I'm not interested in you at any point in this land. And I say, wow, did you really want to do that? Because usually God gets pretty pissed off for being rejected. But in my lifetime, I have people from my family of origin that say that I have a different God than them. And I don't think so. What I think is I have a different approach to religion. What I think is I have a different approach to a singular God, a mother and father God. What I do know, based on my readings, which is a lot more extensive than them, in a lot more different religions, is that there's a different concept for God in every nation and every race. But what I do know is that there's a lot of commonality in the principles. What I do know, there's a lot of, mm, how do we say, alignment in what people are saying. What I do know is that when we look across the spectrum of all the different ways that we can have faith, there are certain commonalities that you can pull out that shows us the truth of God. The truth of God is that he is a rebel, he is a revolutionist, and he is certainly going to help people who want to change the world.